Hi guys, this is Pastor Prophet Justin Roberts from End of the Age Bible Prophecy. I want to present to you my illustration book about the second coming of Jesus Christ. In it you're going to find the illustration book slides and you're going to have uh, me voicing over in the form of narration. So I hope you have great revelations from this presentation. God bless you all. Amen. Revelation 20. After the thousand years, Satan is loosed again. And remember, all the dead that weren't in Christ are going to come back to life again and be like, what just happened? What just happened? Yeah, but they're going to come back. Satan's going to be loosed, probably as Barack Obama again. And he's going to go out and deceive the earth. Um, uh, he's going to go to the far reaches, Gog and Magog, and go for the people who've come back to life again. And the number of them is going to be the sand of the sea, and they're going to surround the holy city, which is Jerusalem. But it says, but fire comes down from God and devours them. Then the dragon, Satan, is cast into the lake of fire where the Antichrist, the beast, and the false prophet are, and their torment shall go up forever and ever. And then comes the great white throne judgment of the people. Because the dead shall be delivered up. And I saw a great white throne and I saw the dead, small and great, stand before God and the books were open. And another book was open, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of those things which were written in their books according to their works. So they're being judged now by their deeds. And Hades and the sea and death all deliver up the dead that are in them so that'll be the end of hell Hades from the earth and they will be judged again but anyone who's not found written in the book of life or anyone who hasn't asked for forgiveness um, shall be cast into the lake of fire so the fearful the unbelieving the abominable like homosexualities, the murderers, whoremongers, sorcerers, like witches, sexually immoral, you know, idolaters, so people who made idols, and all liars, all liars, shall be cast in the lake of fire. Anyone who worshipped the, the beast, the false Christ, uh, William, which is why now is such a bad time, not just for the destruction stuff that's coming but for the deception that's coming people may follow william like he's got like he's he's the man he, you know he's the he's the answer to all the um questions like all the problems so anyone who follows the antichrist or worships him or his image or receives the rfid chip in the right hand or in their foreheads they will also be cast in the lake of fire and their torment will go up forever and ever and there'll be no rest day or night Revelation 21 And the new heaven and a new earth and a new Jerusalem was seen And the new Jerusalem has 12 angels standing on the 12 gates which are like pearls And they're named after the 12 tribes of Israel So Asher, Benjamin and Gad, Issachar, Judah and Joseph, Levi, Manassas and Naphtali, Reuben, Simeon and Zebulun and the wall has 12 foundations named after the apostles of Jesus. And the wall is 65 meters thick, built of jasper. The city is pure gold, transparent like glass. The foundation of the city walls are garnished with 12 precious stones. And the 12 entrance gates be like pearls. There'll be no temple in um the sea so then the the bright light of god can then shine to the whole new earth and god will sit on the throne which is in the middle of the city and like i said his light will shine from it and someone else was mentioning in a video he's been to heaven a lot of times and he says the 144,000 saints will actually be the top row of mansions and they will line they'll go round in a circle like that and they will and also the sea of glasses in the middle 
but the 144,000 will line the the throne or they could so the inner court of it and they'll be able to see God's face from their window they'll be able to see God's throne from their window the 144,000 but then the rest of the um, mansions are all staggered and actually the person said the 144,000 rows of mansions going down like that so it probably would look like a bit like a pyramid as such and yeah and there'll be no night time there it would just be like twilight so there'll be no darkness anymore so beautiful the 12 apostles of jesus peter james john andrew bartholomew james the younger uh, but Ma matthew replaced judas iscariot but i don't know whose name would be there judas thaddeus matthew philip Simon the Zealot and Thomas and the 12 precious stones of New Jerusalem which will garnish the foundations are Jasper, Sapphire, Chalcedony, Emerald, Sardonyx, Sardius, Chrysosolite, Beryl, Topaz, Chrysoprasus, Jacinth, Amethyst. Revelation 22 so how do you become saved you pray to god you admit you are a sinner you ask for forgiveness of your sins and also you forgive those who have sinned against you and then when that is god erases your sins from your book of life so you don't have any of your bad things that have happened in your life according to god's standard but you have all the good stuff that you've done imagine that so when you pray and ask I am a sinner please forgive me of my sins it's done it's done I've been past the prophet Justin Roberts from end of the age of our prophecy God bless you all for watching this presentation I um, hope you have great revelations from it and um, please don't hesitate to give me a contact if you have any questions or queries and um, God bless you all please share this around because the time is short